Hello, good evening again, my brothers and sisters. I'm here to share with you another inspiring poem. And uh, this time, this is not my original. I found this, but I found it so um, inspiring. So I'd like to share it with you. And the title of this is Love, L O V. And the uh, most common um, sign right now is this way, <laughs> love, and also this way, power of love. Um, it is very popular in the Philippines where I'm from. But anyhow, um, this is something that I'm so thrilled to share with you because this is what the world needs right now is love um, the wording on this is a little bit deep and uh, very very meaningful so don't go away stay tuned okay so here it is are you ready I'm ready okay here we go love is giving with no thought of getting it is tenderness enfolding with its strength to protect it is forgiveness without further thought of the thing forgiven it is understanding of the thing forgiven it is understanding of human weakness with knowledge of the true man shining through it is quite in the midst of turmoil it is trust in God with no thought of self it is the one altogether lovely the light in the mother's eyes the glory in the sacrifice the quiet assurance of protection it is the expectation of our father's promise coming through it is the refusal to see anything but good to our fellow man. It is the glory that comes with selflessness and the power that comes with assurance of the Father's love for His children. It is the voice that says no to our brother, though yes, might be more easily said. It is resistance to the words lust and greed thus becoming a positive law of annihilation to error. Love, the one thing no one can take from us, the one thing we can give constantly and become increasingly rich in the giving. Love can take no offense, for it cannot know that which it does not of itself conceive. It cannot hurt or be hurt, for it is the purest reflection of God good. It is the one eternal in this tractable force for good. It is the will of God preparing, planning, proposing always what is best for His universe. Wow, isn't it heavy? <laughs> it's really heavy. It really touched my inner or deepest part of my heart on this because this is what life is about. Our God's love for all of us, for all mankind. And uh, He's so huge and so gigantic when it comes to love when you come to him and ask for forgiveness definitely he will accept you really tight because he loves you very much and it's amazing because as I um, was in a store I found this um, little frame it says live love and love <laughs> see 
that is uh, how God talks to us. He talks to us in a way that when we see things, that's the sign. He wants us to live our life with full of love and we have to be happy and laugh as much as possible and enjoy life because He is the giver of life. We're not going to be here if not for Him. And He wants us to enjoy it so much more that the place is preparing for us is more outstanding and more beautiful than ever than this world. When you think and use your imagination, you can think of the impossible possible. And there are times that I really daydream about what God's preparing for us. <laughs> that place, that beautiful place for His children. So, my brothers and sisters, I want you to be inspired because we have a great God. He is everything we can ever imagine. He is the life. He is the way, the truth, and no one else. That's our Lord Jesus Christ. God came to us in human form through our Lord Jesus Christ. And by the power of the Holy Spirit, He became human. So that He can be among us and feel um, what it is to be human. So He knows exactly how you feel and what you're going through. There's no excuse. <laughs> so my brothers and sisters, I want you to enjoy your life with full of love, okay? Don't go away and I will say my goodbyes. All right, my brothers and sisters, now that uh, you've heard my short and simple sharing, um, it's my time to say my goodbyes again until we meet in my YouTube channel and please subscribe if you have not subscribed yet. And for those that have subscribed and even spent some time listening, I thank you so very much and that uh, God will bless you for that special time you spent listening for He is the one who put me here to where I can give what I can give. <laughs> And I'm always excited to, to really be in touch with you guys there, uh, with everyone. This is the time that we should be focused on our Almighty Father God, Lord Jesus Christ, and the Holy Spirit. Never, ever, ever forget that God loves you very much. And no matter what you're going through, um, family, relationship, financial, um, careers, schools, we all have those problems. And even the nations right now, the whole world, in different parts of the countries are in chaos. But as long as we have that faith in God and that we have love in our hearts, we continue to fight the good fight and caring for one another because that is the test of time, the test that God will definitely know if you are one of His children through the power of love in your heart, through the expression on how you spread the love in your heart. All right? Okay, my brothers and sisters, until next time, and have a great life, and enjoy it one time and that's all I can say for now God bless us all and God loves you and I love you bye for now <laughs>